What is up guys, this is Jello, the casual card gamer, and it is Wednesday night, 9.33 local time here in Ontario. It is our last night, did I did it already? I did. Alright, it is our last night of the road trip before we head back to Calgary, and I figured that we'd make this a little special by opening up a lot of stuff. I know that I normally open up like boxes on this series, but hey! We got all these <laughs> basically just some blisters and stuff. And I do have Jordan back with me to do this because um, I would say that it's the last time in a while, but he's gonna be <laughs> coming to Calgary <laughs> in a few weeks, so he'll, you'll see him again. But yeah, I have, um, I, have, I have him to help me out to open up all of these because my luck is abysmal with trying to get you know what out of you know what. You know who out of you know what. And all of these, and I did get some Destiny soldiers from Dollies. I figured that I might as well, you know, trick out some of the Destiny heroes that we have in the deck, you know, make them look a little shiny. So let's see what we get out of all of this stuff, and hopefully, uh, you guys don't have to look at the same deck profile for the fourth week, I think, in a row. Let's get crack a light. Let's start with the. Let's start with this. Alright, you ready? Oh. So, as always, we are looking for Elemental Hero Adjusted Gold, uh, Evil Hero Adjusted Gold, and uh, Malicious Bane. My friend came up with a saying, like, every every villain is lemons. Every, you just have to keep saying, every villain is lemons. I hope so, they're evil. It should be the fourth part of the pack. Ah, oh, okay, so, we begin again with... All the foils that are not what we're looking for. Dumpy, Dumpy, Dump Puppet, Hila, no, no. So far, so good? Well, if we're going by usual standards, then yes. <laughs> don't get um, uh, Malicious Bane or a Dusted Gold out of this, I'm just going to- OH MY GOD! OH MY GOD! Finally! I got you, I got you. Have I ever let you down oh before? My no. Oh my god, we got it! Oh. Oh. oh! How many of these have you opened? Too many! <laughs> Way too many! Oh my god! Oh. It's, a good, it's a good thing I asked you to open these. My days will no longer be full of sadness and emptiness. Well, here we go. We have how many boosters left? Yeah. Six. Let's see if we can get a dust gold. Oh. Left this one right side. I'm very sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Take your time. God. Oh my god, huh? Don't look at mine, you're gonna... No, it's okay. It's okay. If you pull it, if you pull it... I never have to touch this set ever again. Okay. Last right, booster, right. it's the last booster of Destiny. Oh my god. Nervous. For you. <laughs> it's okay, I'm, I'm like... <laughs> you know how much this guy is? No, it's like a hundred dollars. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Oh, no. It's okay. It's okay, guys. We got Malicious Bane. And you know what? I, it's all that matters. Oh, my God. It's beautiful. We're just going to put him right there. We're just going to have him as the centerpiece for this episode. It's probably going to be the best thing that we draw all day today. So, here you go. Alright, Dark Neostorm. Mystic Minds. 
uh, Cross Crusader, and Fusion Destiny. Let's go. Memories of Hope? Nope. Cards. I don't think any of them are like super short. Pretty good stuff. We got like I think two or three ultras. Well, anyway, sick. We've gotten one thing out of. All the sets so far, we are down to our vanity, <laughs> our vanity section of the of the video. Let's see what we get. So we're looking for any. Oh, there we go, Destiny Hero Plasma. <laughs> Very nice. Destiny Hero Decider. Actually, I was I'm on the fence about using Decider. So you haven't decided? I haven't decided yet. Hopefully we get a... Uh, malicious? Nope. Okay, so... But oh, we did get a... We did get a... Platform, so. this, I guess, and this. You got one too? Yeah, I did. But I only need one, so, oh. yeah. It's not as hype, but it's still pretty cool. Hey guys, so before we get to the, the deck profile, I was looking through my tin of stuff that I got so far. I couldn't find a specific card, but I'll get to that later. But I did find one more Immortal Destiny, as you guys can see. I am not, I am not uh, fooling any of you, this is a card, this is a pack that we, that I missed in the beginning, so let's see if it's the last card we need out of this godforsaken set. What is that be? I know, it would be. Oh, it's a, uh, oh well. 
Alright, well, we did get, we did get, um, we did get most boys, so. Let's get on to the deck profile. We're gonna start with the extra deck like we usually do, because there's actually a change! This time. For our extra heroes, we have Dread Decimator and Wonder Driver, both are very good at facilitating our plays and combos. Our elemental heroes are Elemental Hero Sunrise, The Shining, and Absolute Zero. The Sunrise helps us get, um, Miracle Fusion and pop something whenever a, a hero is involved in an attack. The Shining punches really hard and Absolute Zero blows up all the monsters on your opponent's field once it leaves the field. Our masked heroes, we have Anki, Blast, Diane, Acid, and Double Dark Law. <clears throat> so Anki lets us flip our Masked Heroes, Blast is spot removal, and also make sure that our Stratos goes through if it gets uh, hand trapped or something. And Diane, well Diane is just there for uh, Solid Soldier for the same reason as Blast. Acid is best friend with Absolute Zero, they are, the, the two of them together are a field nuke, blows up both front row and back row, and Dark Law is Dark Law, he has to be there or else this deck is not very threatening. <laughs> Next, we have Destiny Hero Dominance, Destiny Hero Dystopia, and Destiny Hero Dangerous. Uh, Dominance lets us play around with our opponent's top deck, Dystopia lets us blow things up as long as he's bigger than he usually is, and Dangerous is easy to bring out. And our newest addition to the roster, we have Evil Hero Malicious Bane. Finally, after I think it's been a month of trying to get this guy actively, it's crazy that we were able to pull him uh, and that we did have Jordan on is so, so amazing. He does so much for the deck, he blows up the field, he gets bigger when he does, and he can't be destroyed by battle or conflict. So that is our extra deck. And on to the main deck. We have, of course, our Vision Hero package. We have two, three Ferris, two Increase, and two Bions. We already know what all of these do. This is, this is the reason why uh, heroes are so viable at all anymore. We have three Elemental Hero Shadow Mists, two Elemental Hero Shadows, one Liquid Soldier, and one Solid Soldier, and one Honest Neos. Uh, Shadow Mist helps us get mass changes or search out uh, heroes. Stratos searches heroes and blows up back row, depending on how many other uh, hero monsters we have on the field. Solid Soldier is a graceful charity or a monster reborn. Solid Soldier gets us an extra summon, and Honest Neos is is honest. <laughs> Next we have Destiny Hero Plasma, Malicious, Decider, Celestial, and Draw Hand. So I decided take out um, Dynatag just to just to give this uh, just to give this lineup a try. I didn't want to saturate this uh, list with too many Destiny heroes. Um, but I do think that Destiny uh, that Decider will come a little more in clutch uh, than Dynatag when it comes to uh, being able to pull out wins. And lastly I put in one Evil Hero Infernal Prodigy. It was supposed to be Sinister Necrom, but I cannot find where I put him. So when we get back to Calgary, this will change uh, as soon as we do. So yeah, that is it for the monsters of the deck. And last we have Mass Changes, 2 Fusion Destiny, Miracle Fusion, Polymerization, and Dark Calling, finally. <laughs> These are all of our fusion uh, slash monster changing cards in the deck. Everybody knows what Mass Change does. Fusion Destiny is a one card combo. Uh, not really a combo, it's a one card fusion. Miracle Fusion we can get straight off of Sunrise. Polymerization we can get off of uh, Vion. Dark Calling is the only card out of this besides Mass Change. Actually, you can search Mass Change. Dark Calling is the only card that we have to hard draw to be able to use. But uh, other than that, it's always good to have if, since we have uh, Malicious Bane in the deck now. And lastly, we have three emergency calls for searching elemental heroes, one a hero lives uh, if we don't have a field, and we have life points to spare, which we always will. 
one Rhoda, one warrior returning alive. These are our searchers of the deck. And lastly, we have a Mystic Mine for uh, for degenerate plays. We have one Twin Twisters, one Destiny Draw for pitching Distant Heroes, and one Foolish Burial for pitching anything. And that is the deck list now, guys. I hope you guys liked the changes. And that is it for this week's Zero to Hero Hero Sealed Only Deck Challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys, um, I hope you guys say thank you in the comments to Jordan for pulling that card because I probably would have done some kind of weird magic thing where it changed into something completely different if it was me who opened the booster. Anyway, guys, as always, please don't forget to like, subscribe, leave your comments, suggestions down below for future content. Uh, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Links to both of those will be down in the description. And, uh, yeah, as always, this is Jello, the casual card gamer, and this is Jordan, the more casual card gamer. Take care.